Well, we know supporting restaurants has been crucial to the economy, and a lot of people are doing their best there. Sean Chitnis live, and Sean, the governor, wants all of us to curb the virus so he can keep those places open. Jim, the governor also said that even with a high positivity rate, you can support the restaurants right now by making to-go orders or ordering delivery. But of course, this is that concern right now about what can be done so that people feel comfortable. Keeping cases down will certainly help people to continue to go out to eat. This all happening while the industry itself is trying to figure out what it can do to invite people to dine out during the winter. So today, Governor Jared Polis announced that the state of Colorado is partnering with the Colorado Restaurant Association as well as groups of engineers and architects to prepare for outdoor dining in the winter. The governor acknowledged that the restaurant industry has been hit especially hard by the pandemic, some closing, others struggling to stay open. According to the Restaurant Association, if nothing changes, 65% of restaurants could close within six months. So in addition to figuring out quick and low-cost options for the outdoors, there will be financial assistance available, including money from donations going to the Colorado Relief Fund. XL Energy and its foundation will give $500,000 and pledge to match up to, one, uh, up to another $250,000 for other donations. We want Colorado's restaurant industry to bounce back, to be resilient. The health of our restaurant industry is, is essential to our state's recovery and to our way of life. So the next step in this process is a workshop that is scheduled on Monday, bringing the restaurant industry together with those groups of architects and engineers. Live tonight in downtown Denver, Sean Chetness covering Colorado First.